Hi, I'm Susan, and you're watching Van Tales Stories from the Road. This is my van, the Samwise Van G, and this is Tryon Palace in New Bern, North Carolina. In this episode, I'm going head to head van versus palace, and we'll see who comes out on top. is like a museum it's very beautiful and very cold and you're not allowed to touch anything on the other hand this entryway looks nice and cozy and well welcoming Turning it, 
back and forth, back and forth, back and forth in the ice yeah. until you have ice cream. That's so that is actually a winter delicacy in this time period. Yeah. Because that's about the only time you can actually get ice shipped down here as far south as North Carolina. Fascinating. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. You're very welcome. an extravagant palace with servants and a butler and my own chef. I don't have stables. Well, I don't have a horse either, so that doesn't really count. But what I do have is a sweet van. I wouldn't part with Samwise Vanshee for two Tryon palaces. Maybe I would for three. To see all the ins and outs of the Samwise Vanshee, check out the linked van tour above. So I had some fun with this for sure, but I really did enjoy my tour, and what you see in the episode is just a small portion of the palace and grounds. Much thanks to the amazing docents that brought the palace to life. And for those picklers in the group, you know who you are. Check out how the chef pickled these 18th century vegetables. Pickle you, Comquat. Take care, and I'll see you down the road. Adding back to, uh, so I have a little bit of okra here. Uh, some peppers, um, and it's pretty simple. Uh, all you're really going to do is just kind of cut your okra into rounds. Just like that. Take your rounds, and then you're just going to drop those right into your pot. For your crock. Give it a little stir. And then cap it again. And if I was done, I would seal it up. And I would use this. Now this is an imitation one, but in the day they would use uh, what was known as a pig bladder. Uh, you use a pig bladder to be able to seal it because it's a waterproof membrane and you get it concealed. Uh, so you would just stretch that uh, pig bladder over top and then you would tie that into place and then that's how you would store it until you are ready to use it. How long does it take? Huh? How long would you take? About a week. Oh. Yep, just like many other pickling recipes, let it sit for about a week and then all the flavors start to melt together and you get a really good. Uh, nice pickle vegetable recipe. 